am Dr. Rajesh Kesavan. I am a consultant podiatrist and a diabetic food specialist uh, practicing in Chennai. Palpate your feet. Just touch your feet on the bottom and see if there are some areas where there are some bumps or where there are any thickening of skin which are also called as callosities, uh, whether there are any tender spots in the feet. If these are there, you need to take the help of uh, your doctor. And when a wound happens, again, the doctor will advise you to go in for uh, some procedures or he will put you on antibiotics, he will clean the wound. And more important, he will advise you to offload that wound. Offloading is preventing any sort of pressure on the wound. So even if you, uh, when on the streets, you, know, you see a dog getting injured, what it will do, it will just limp. It will see that the injured extremity does not touch the ground. So that becomes important. So that is nature's way of protecting ourselves. But because of diabetes, that protection is not there. So these patients, we see them frequently walking happily on their wounds. So this makes, uh, again, wound get bigger and deeper, and many times make it get infected and get complicated. Uh, one of the ways what we have found out helps in healing these difficult to heal wounds in addition to your routine surgical therapy and medical therapy is hyperbaric oxygen therapy. So in addition to patients with difficult wounds and uh, diabetic foot wounds, uh, again where there is some amount of borderline ischemia, all these cases we have found uh, a good amount of healing. Um, we even uh, published a paper uh, recently uh, we had published an uh, article in a very famous journal called Free Radical Biology and Medicine uh, where we looked at how hyperbaric oxygen therapy helps in healing diabetic foot wounds. So what we observed is this uh, stimulates something called as NRF2 in your bloodstream and helps in increasing what is called as angiogenesis and what and again it increases the blood uh, vessels formation uh, in the foot so that helps in bringing in more nutrition to the wound and helps in healing these wounds faster hyperbaric oxygen therapy is also quite effective in various other areas for example uh, radiation osteonecrosis of the mandible radiation cystitis um, and again, a number of uh, more than 13 indications are FDA approved as far as hyperbaric oxygen therapy is concerned.